we are not in the kitchen today, visiting family in Florida for a few days, specifically my brother in Cape Coral at his Villa Coco K rental house. We were only there two days. We went for a walk on our first morning in Cape Coral and were pleasantly surprised to learn about their burrowing owls. Whenever an owl starts digging a burrow in a new place, it becomes off limits to humans. The area is marked with small white PVC pipe markers and a small perch is added to help the birds survey their domain. These birds are serious cute. By the way, they dig their own burrows, apparently the only ground dwelling birds in the world who do their own digging. The western burrowing owls use unoccupied prairie dog burrows or other pre-made homes. It was in the cool of the morning when we visited the birds the first time and several were on guard standing outside their burrows. Later I came back with my camera and tripod but it was in the heat of the day and the birds had retreated into the opening of their burrow for its relative coolness. The next morning I came back to shoot video but that record-breaking January 2014 cold wave that swept the country had reached Cape Coral and the temperatures had plummeted but were still above freezing. The bad part was the wind was blowing very hard. I tried some videoing but the wind made my camera and tripod vibrate making the video unusable. So I had to resort to hand holding the camera. It still was not great but much better than using the tripod. Here are a few facts from the Cornell University Lab of Ornithology that you might find interesting. The burrowing owl is different from other owls in that both the male and female are the same size. The burrowing owl appears to be diurnal as opposed to nocturnal. However, it hunts day and night, usually collecting more insects during the day and more small mammals at night. They are most active in the morning and the evening. The birds are 7.5 to 10 inches tall, with a wingspan of about 21 inches. They weigh a little over 5 ounces. These owls live in dry open areas such as vacant lots, lawns, golf courses, cemeteries, university campuses, airports, prairie dog towns, and pastures. The female lays 2 to 12 white eggs in the burrow nest. The hatchlings are helpless, eyes closed and covered with gray down. The burrowing owl catches its food with its feet while walking, hopping, or running on the ground. Sometimes they catch their prey by flying from their perch. Populations are decreasing in some areas, but human activity in Florida has helped that population. The major source of mortality is highways and their many vehicles. Burrowing owls live on the west coast and Mexico, except for those who live in Florida. Unlike the snowbirds, these little guys stay all year round, and you can bet that my next visit to this area will include a better prepared effort to video them.